the weekly Kentucky Fish and Wildlife Fishing Report, brought to you by the Cane Pole in Southern Hills Plaza. This is Marcy Anderson with the Fishing Report for Southeast Kentucky. Surface water temperatures in area lakes and reservoirs are running in the low to mid 80s, and lake levels in the major reservoirs continue to fall, which means anglers may have to get creative in terms of tactics in order to get on some fish. On Lake Cumberland, anglers are still having success picking up straight bass in the early morning hours in the lower portion of the main lake and major tributary. Target areas in the 50 to 80 feet range using live shad for your best chance at catching one. Black bass bite has been variable. Evening and night hours are still being more productive. Target main lake points and ledges for smallmouth and pockets with cover for largemouth bass. Crappie have been hit or miss as of late, but some are still being picked up in 15 to 20 feet of water on minnows. On the Cumberland tailwater, dissolved oxygen levels had been running somewhat low, so sluice gates are now in operation to help raise the oxygen level in the tailwater. The open sluice gates will make for some rough water in the area near the dam on the tailwater side, so use caution when fishing in the area. In addition to the sluice gates, generation flows are variable during the day, but lower flows are still occurring on the weekends to make conditions favorable for anglers and boaters. Trout fishing has been good on the tailwater as of late, with some nice rainbows trout being caught. On Dale Hollow, fishing has been somewhat slow for bass. Anglers have been having some success catching largemouth on spinnerbaits and jigs. Fish are somewhat scattered, with some being shallow and woody structures and others being deep in up to 40 feet of water. Grass beds are always a good option to target bass on Dale Hollow. The walleye bite has slowed down, but some are still being picked up trolling crankbaits in 25 feet of water. Also, rainbow trout stocking will soon be underway in the fall for Rock Creek and McCrory County. They can be caught on a variety of lures, including small spinners, worms, and corn. So as always, good luck and good fishing. Thank you.